And so the celebrations begin, and well earned they are indeed. It may have looked simple at times, but as any racing driver can tell you, competing at this level, at the very top, is anything but simple. There's no catching them now then. We have a new World Drivers Champion. That's a fantastic performance from Ferrari. It hardly looked in doubt. Anthony, what do you think made the difference here? Well, tyre management probably played quite a large role in the outcome of this one. As ever, it's not just about speed, it's all about maintaining that speed consistently over a stint, over a race distance. So being able to keep up the lap times while still being smooth on the controls and gentle on the tyres, that's really where the race was won today. So, here they come now, out onto the podium. Wherever you go, anywhere in the world, the prancing horse flags are dominant in the grandstands and they're out in force again today. It's Ferrari on the top step once more. So then, it's time to see how this result affects the Drivers' Championship. We also crown a new champion today, as their lead at the top is now an insurmountable one. What a great year it's been for Formula One. And now I'd like to ask you, Anthony Davidson, who was your driver of the day? Oh, well, it's got to be Lewis Hamilton. He was fast, decisive, everything you'd want from a top-class driver. The Constructors' title may already be decided, but the lead at the top comes down after a strong weekend from the challenging pack. Another team that excelled today was Williams, who make further progress up the table. That's it for today's Grand Prix, and from Ant and I, it's goodbye, and see you again next time.